Hey, it's Drug Lines, and uh, the other day I mentioned, um, I, man, what was I doing? I, I was, uh, I was playing around with this, uh, oh, I created a separate script for it. Um, I downloaded it from the forum, basically, and then made some minor tweaks to it. Because I use fine text, let me go ahead and launch, let me see what I got going here. Oh, it is running. Here we go. So, um, what I did was... I incorporated my little finding of the area. So first off, and if you haven't seen my other videos on using this function, it's a pretty cool function. Um, go check them out. I'll put a link in the description here. But um, basically you come in here and you say, hey, if you were looking to click something or to go to move your mouse over it and then do something with it, um, it can be it can be anything, right? You can be an image or it can be text. It doesn't matter. It's called fine text, but don't let that throw you. So let's say I wanted to, to, to Wish I had a button on the page. It doesn't matter, right? All right. So let's just say I wanted to I wanted to click that. So this here gets the 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 overall area. I'm gonna trim it up some. So that's this is what I wanted to find, and I need to convert it to grayscale and say okay. And now I can hit this test button, and it's gonna come back and say oh it, look, and it took 562 milliseconds to find it, and then it says the position, right? So here's where it is. Um, the results is okay, just means it actually found it. And then once I hit okay, it's going to move the mouse to it. So see, there it goes. So bam, it's there. Great. That's awesome. Um, but that five, that's, that's over a half a second to find that. And that's part of it's because I have three decently large screens. And so it searches everywhere for it, right? So depending on where it starts, it can take a long time. Um, so I thought, Hey, you know, it'd be great. You know, he, they describe how you can adjust the area on where it's searching, right? And, and here it's going from 368, 112 to, um, what is that? 150,000. Yeah. So that's a, a pretty big area on each way. Um, but what I want to be able to do, so I added this, so I can click specify area and then I can come up and say, you know, I think it's going to be in this region. And now on my clipboard, see the little tool tip. So then I can come back in here and replace these first, I think it's four points. And now when I test it, notice it took. I don't even know what that is, right? It's it's less than a 20th of a second, right? So it, it the speed really increases when you shrink down that area. Um, and what I, of course, it's still, it, it does all the testing and stuff. But um, I wanted to be able to, because often, if you work like I do, I have certain programs in certain places, and the button is going to be, you know, within a, a couple millimeters. But this way, like let's say with web scraping, you're having trouble clicking a button, and it's not sending it. Well, this way, you can literally send your mouse there, click it, and it'll activate it, um, or, or you know, opening, hitting an open button or save button or whatever, right? But um, sometimes if I'm in a hurry and I don't need a robust, fully-fledged, calm solution for web scraping or something like that. Um, I'll throw this in there cause it's really fast for me to, to do this. And so, um, I, I cheated a little because I was going to incorporate the two scripts together. And so I just have one script to share. Unfortunately, the, this, um, fine text script actually uses some of the same hotkeys and I was going to have to rewrite a bunch of stuff. And so I said, you know what, screw it. I'll, I'll create a subroutine for this. So this specify area, basically I click this, it comes down here and tells it to run this other script in a whole different script, right? And that way the, the hotkeys, even though they conflict, they're in different scripts. And since the second one launches, um, it, when it launches, it becomes the preferential, uh, how to, the, the one that'll get the focus. And so, um, that's it. I just thought, uh, I'd, uh, I'll, I'll put both of the files, um, on this on the the source page here and um or just links to download them or whatever but um awesome hope you guys are having a great day cheers